flowers. Seems strange they should often disappear. I hate this island. Who could have thought that we could have lost them when they are moving so slowly and we are free to move as fast as we like? But every minute we lose sight of my sisters and those dreadful pirates is another chance we lose to free them from their captivity. I know this. And if we only knew what those pirates wanted your sisters for, maybe we could find it and buy your sisters back with you. And poor Miss Cross, of course. Well, um, I wasn't exactly thinking about her. Seems to me your high and mighty tutor, Miss Cross, could use being taken down a few pegs. Mr. Brodish, I'm surprised at you. I know you and Miss Cross didn't exactly get along. But even an hour of cruel suppression with those horrible pirates is a fate I wouldn't wish on my own worst enemy. I oh, know, Miss. Sorry, Miss. At any rate, we've got to free all of them, agreed? Agreed. And the first thing we should do is... Wait! I hear something coming! We've got to hide! Pick up the pace, ladies! Captain Cross will be warning us firewood pile before lunch! Oh, lunch! Ah, don't get excited! Roach is talking about our lunch, not yours! <laughs> Besides, some of us could stand and lose a few pounds, eh? For us <laughs> oh, just stop it for your cow. My name is Miss Cross, and I am not a cow nor any other beast of burden. And you filthy women should be ashamed of yourselves. Because you disgusting little harridan, you have squandered your God-given feminine gifts, and now you wish to denigrate the rest of us decent women and bring us down to your level. My level? Get her, Tani. <laughs> well, Miss Cross, maybe if Mr. Roach over there takes his whip to your behind, you'll learn who the masters are here and who are the slaves. Hey, we're nobody slaves. Our father is a respected judge. Our father could buy and sell a lot of you. So your dad's rich, eh? Well, that's good to know. Yeah, Captain Quelch's orders was to release you and make sure you got off the island when you were done. Ooh, but now, maybe we'll just tell him you was released and hide you somewheres and ransom you off to your money bags, Daddy, later. <laughs> you monsters! Move it out, ladies, walk! Not a chance. We take our orders from Captain Quelch, oh, not right. you. Yeah. Bullies, bullying a bunch of coward gir captured girls. At least let Amy rest a moment. She's young and unwell. Oh, Miss Edith, do not lower yourself to beg anything from these Visigoths. Here, you! What's that mean? It refers to a particular breed of barbarian, you ignorant savage. Hi, who are you calling a savage? Oh, oh, hey! Take that off. I'll give you a taste of my whip. Uh, you girls get moving, I'll deal with you later. Yeah, we go aren't going on. anywhere. On. We're not afraid of you. We're going to stand here and watch you do it, if you have the nerve. A remarkable showing of bravery, Miss Edith. I'm proud of you. She's proud? No. Are you crazy, lady? I'm going to whip the tar out of you. No, you are not. Even the youngest girl here can see you lot for what you are. Bullies and cowards, the lot of you. Hey, don't take that from that witch, Mr. Rose. Hit her! Yeah, hit her right across. Just to put you to work, so I ain't gonna do it. Do what? I ain't gonna hit you! There, you satisfied, lady? <laughs> Quite, Mr. Roach. You have proved yourself an excellent object lesson. Ladies, bullies and cowards will always back down against true force of character. So be brave, young ladies, and let them build their tiny authority into the steel of your resolve. Understood? Yes, Miss Cross. And now, ladies, as Mr. Roach has been so kind as, as, as to inform us as the extent of their orders in our regards to our treatment, we need have no fear of them, and we may deal with them with great dispatch. Why, what do you mean? What I mean, you little homunculus, is that although you lot are forbidden to strike us, we fortunately are under no such orders ourselves. And so therefore, ladies, bundles up, Wait, what? Uh, no! And now, ladies, attack! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Bonnie, ma'am. You know me, sailor. Oh, anyone who lives and works on the water knows and respects the name of Anne Bonnie, Captain Bonnie, ma'am. And you've worked on the water a long time. You sure you were never a pirate, mister? His name is Mr. Brodish, and that's just what I was thinking. My name is Felicity Day. He came to this island with me, and those pirates just fought at my sister and Judy as their captive. Well, that still don't tell me why you're here, so tell me and be honest. I can always spot a liar. What do you know about the windjammer? We only just heard you mention a few minutes ago for the first time, honestly. And they mentioned something about a diamond, don't forget. Oh, the windjammer and the diamond are one and the same. It is the biggest, most brilliantly cut gem you'll ever see. And what's more, most of the pirate brethren consider it lucky. Lucky? How could a gem be lucky? Oh, legend has it that 
Whichever ship keeps the diamond safe in its hold will find the wind with it wherever it sails. Unless the captain of that ship holds the diamond in his hand. And then the luck fails, and it passes to a new owner. Like magic. And it's been lost to us all for years and years and years. Until rumors started surfacing that a map led to its last location. The map was cut into six pieces. And sewn in six separate packets. Each a different color. And all of them were lost. Until a local freebooter named Welch started bragging it that he had found the first packet and intended to find them all. Tis a fantastic tale and a marvelous prize. Uh, for them what can find it and keep it. me for whatever you need, miss. You know that. You can count on me too, uh, but not for free. What do you want? I don't have any money. Oh, it ain't money I need, but uh, you seem to be fairly smart. Oh, why? That she is. Smart as paint is our Miss Felicity. And you're small. You've obviously been successful at staying out of Quetch's way all day. Uh, it's yes. it's so I'll help you. Find your sisters and you'll me. help me find my blue packet. Deal? Deal. Yeah. <laughs>